Hello everyone, welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! on Dueling Network. I'm Arrow in the Knee. Today we're looking at the Evil Swarms again. Um, I've been changing this deck up a bit. I think Evil Swarm Low Lantern isn't that good. But I just needed more Evil Swarms. Getting the first turn Orpheon down is just insanely, you know, you need to do it. Uh, if you want deck list for this, guys, I'm just hovering over it. Just pause it during the fucking video, just if you want to see it. This guy, Swarming Lantern, is just a little tech. Uh, I'm not sure if I want it in there. Tug, I'm not sure about tour guides. I'm really not. But if you can't get the first turn of Orpheon, it's just really good to have. In fact, they're probably going out. Let's, uh, I don't know what to replace them with, though. Maybe some traps or Allure of Darkness is there. We just got someone talking to us. Duel? Sure, give me a sec. Um. I probably should have done this before. I just didn't think uh, I was going to be doing anything like this. What's a, in general, decent card? Well, let's put another Mystical Space Typhoon in there. You can't really have too many of those. And let's pop in a Torrential. Yeah, that's always good. Um, so yeah. This guy wants to play me, so hmm, he's in the he's perfect time. Uh, he's hosting. Okay, let's look for yon yonder. There we go. All right, it's time to do do duel and shit. Uh, he wants scissors. A guy who chooses scissors would tend to change. So I'm gonna get paper. Yeah. You know what people actually choose on their first one kind of dictates what they're gonna choose on their second. Usually, anyway. Um. We drew a Thunderbird. So, a couple of cards. Pandemic. It's just such a good card. Makes things untaggable. I'm not sure if I should have took it, but I want to be able to take something out at least. Um. Mm. Don't want to get rid of this guy. Not sure if I should have set Pandemic. You know, I'm really not sure. Let's uh, yeah, let's let it go. If he drops something like Guaba now, I'm just gonna fucking scoop Lila. Hmm, that's annoying. That was really annoying. I lost so much. I know I should have just banished it. Ah. <sighs> I haven't, I haven't played that enough, so... Note to self. Yeah. Is he running Starlight? I don't think he would. I think this is just going to be an easy storm. But I have nothing to follow up with, so... Hmm. Ah, and of course he's running Starlight. You know, in Light Swans. Oh yeah, shit, I'd better ch chain this. Uh, and I drew terrible from that as well. Uh, let's play Mystical Space Typhoon. Oh, I let it go! I wanted him to negate the starter so I could draw again. Okay, let's fucking... I don't even know what I said. That's going in my hand. <laughs> Not setting. Lol. Ah, uh, I think I've lost this. Just true. Yeah. It's 1-0. 1-0! 1-0! I made a mistake. I made a mistake in the first turn, guys. I knew I should have removed, I knew I shouldn't have even set the pandemic. And I opened back. You know. This, uh, just whatever. Just whatever. Fucking. I, I opened bad. Can I stop opening bad? Um. Actually, that's not that bad. Uh. Yeah. Go. Got the maxi. I just wanted to summon something. And boom. I'm going to go into Orpheon. Uh. So. Just 16. Or is he going to play some other bullshit? I'm not sure if he attacked, but I'll let him have it. Special summon! Uh, normal summon. Shame I can't actually get over it without going into Orpheon, because uh, he could, uh, by all rights, have Honest in his hand. So let's detach 
uh, Kerry Kerry Tun guy. Um, I would grab infection, but I've got nothing in my hand. But let's go pandemic. Swear to God, if he has honest, if he has honest, it's the worst fucking thing ever. Yeah, baby, no honest. Uh, so pandemic, so mystical space typhoon, and go. Uh, he, I'm not. I think this really does counter him a lot because he can't drop judgment dragon. But we will see. Though I'm sure he still has other ways around it, like dropping wolf into Celestia, which I can't stop. Uh, although it seems like he has a lot of big level monsters, which makes me happy. Um, okay. So he's gonna drop. And I will also drop. Drop my Maxi, I get to draw again, which works perfectly with my deck. Uh, here's Lila. Oh, there goes my MST, sad face. He gets drop six at the end of the turn, but I think he's just delaying the inevitable. Uh, oh, cool. I get to draw again. That's pretty cool. Draw! Draw more cards! Uh, I'd imagine he's going to exceed as well. Yes! Draw more cards! I need to draw Caster, though, because he's obviously going to go over me. Yeah. Uh, but I can, I can still bring him out again. That's good. That's great. Um, so I take 50, 1,000, but I, I can get it out again. I've got I've got Pandemic, so he can't stop me either, unless he's got something like Warning. Um, so he drops three at the end of the turn. Um, Lights one Barrier. I remember that card. Do I have... Th oh, shit. Didn't realise that. Backhand Dragon! Boom! Let's banish Magigor. Well, fuck. Oops. Banish top. Target. Um. Banish. Target. Reinforcement the army. Uh, get Caster. Magigora. Um, I'm gonna go into Orpheon first so he can't drop Gauls or Trike. Uh, I, I lose a bit of damage, but, you know, then I have to go into Orpheon and have a, a, a Gauze looking back at me, which I don't really want. So we're going to go through our deck grab infection, because that can give us uh, our big old loot. So, attack both. The only thing you can stop me with is Fader. And this is where I set pretty much everything. Okay, stop one of the attacks. I'm just going to play Infection. Uh, oops. To top it up, I'm going to grab Kiri Kiri on guy. This guy is just the fucking dumbest monsters I've ever released. But yeah, I, th I think I've locked this game up. Unless he's got something insanely crazy going on. One, two, three. He can't drop Judgment Dragon at the moment. Uh, four in hand. I, I just can't imagine he's got anything. I mean, he is Reborn, so he can't go anything crazy. He could go Lumina to Lumina, and still, even then, it's a bit iffy. So, we'll see. I, I've run an XYZ Reborn in this, because Orpheon's just awesome. Uh, I, I'm so sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to let him do that. I'm going to let him bring whatever he wants out, and I'm going to solemn the Exceed Monster. And I think that should be it. If, if uh, Yeah, I can't see it. I think this is over. It's a bit dumb if it's not, to be honest. It's fine, man. So. Oh, he's just ending there. I did not expect that. I guess it just wants to mill a lot, but I, I don't think he has a win condition at the moment. So he's got a Necro Gardener in there. He can stop one of my attacks, but not enough. It's really just not enough. So I'm going to banish Orpheon. Special Summon Caster. 
uh, Caster's Effect, get our Heliotrope. I can, I can go into, uh, what's his name? Ouroboros, uh, which, if I remember correctly, is kind of like an infinity thing. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, so I can target card he controls, return to the hand, send a card in your opponent's hand to the graveyard. Target one card in your opponent's graveyard and banish it. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna take one from his hand. Because I guess we can. <laughs> That's pretty much it. A lot of people might be thinking, why didn't you banish the Necrogun? That's because you can chain Necrogun. Which has always bothered me a little bit. Uh, hopefully that last card in his hand isn't honest, but I'm I'm going to be attacking it with the Darkhound Dragon, so he just can't, yeah, uh, draw into Judgment Dragon and stuff. I've got Solemn Judgment. It's 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 you know it's done. It's done. It's over. I mean, I've got Solemn Judgment. Oh snap! <sighs> Poor guy. Yep. It's one all. Let's make it uh, a good two out of three. I just need to draw a really, you know, monster heavy hand. I've just been drawing spells lately. I got really lucky in that last game that I drew my sixth card. There we go. I can make. Oh, I can make a lot here. I don't like drawing Heliotrope ever. But yeah, what can you do? Let's see what he opens. Uh, Gareth, who I actually really like. I think he's one of the unsung heroes of Light Swarms. Uh, he's got two Light Swarms in the Grave and a Judgment Dragon. Any good Light Swarm deck will run three Monster Incarnation because it's just such a dumb card. It's pretty much a monster reborn for Judgment Dragon, which you can get at any point. So three Light Swarms in the Grave, a Necro Gardener. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Okay, um. Madrigor. Caster. Even if he torrential here, I'd be able to summon Carry Carry On and use its effect, get back one of these guys. Um, Alright, let's go for it. Cause he, look, if he bottomless this, yeah, it would be cool. Effect. Uh, let's drop Caster to the grave and grab um, Pandemic. I really, really want uh, the Infection though because I've got so many in my hand. I want to kind of cycle them. Battle phase, boom! Honest. Uh, when a face of lights one once you control the selects as an attack target, you can send the top two cards and negate the attack. I'm not quite sure if that affects my monster, but either way, I'm going to let it go because. Honestly, I don't know the ruling. Um, but he still can't special summon anything big. Uh, he, he can Celestia me, but... Eh, I don't think he's got Celestia. Okay. Bothers me he's got a Light Swarm Barrier. Uh, I can get rid of it though, I think. He's got a lot of monsters in his grave. That's for sure. Um, Alright. Detach. Go through the deck, grab uh, the Infection, which is my favourite card in this deck, to be honest. It's so fucking powerful. With Kiri Kiri on. Kiri... What is it called? Kiri Ki... I don't even fucking... Um, I like this guy. He's a pyro, though. What the hell? If only he had 200 friends. Okay, so... The reason we did that is that we can summon this guy. If... Effect. We banish... Madragora, and we special summon him. Well, we normal summon him, actually. And then we... Hmm. Yeah, we... Does it go to the grave or anything? No, we just get an extra normal summon. Okay, let's go Heliotrope. Let's make another Rothion. Uh, send the caster to the grave. We also want the caster in the grave. Uh, we'll go through for a pandemic. Now, the thing is, this is Raikou. 
Uh, he can kill my Orpheon, and he could go for game. But because of infection, we can kind of cycle through and get more back. We can get another Orpheon out. So, man, it bothers me. I really want to get rid of that fucking Light Swarm barrier. But let us kill the face down. Yeah, it's Ryko. Um, okay, so he kills my guy. He mills three. That is fine. Slightly worried about this barrier. When a face up lights from once you control the selects attack type, it's in the top two cards decks the graveyard and negate the attack. That would affect a monster. Yeah, it would. Fairly said. I think you can still mill though. Yeah. Oh man. I'm tired. Okay, we're gonna set infection, end our turn. Outright play the infection first. Sucks we don't have an Orpheon, but yeah. Infection's there. Just putting it face up. Um nice one barrier, is that kinda I know it's oh, shit. Um, Put this guy to the top of my deck. And let's grab a Kirikiri on. That's also chain pandemic. Uh, let's hope he doesn't know anything crazy. I mean, yeah, he's got the four K attacker. That's fine. Uh, that's eight thousand damage, but I have a monster in the way. Uh, so, shit, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, so this guy got really lucky. Really lucky. He's nowhere near as good as me. Um, but yeah. Uh, I'm not sure if I should have... I, I could have got a bit more damage on him, but all in all, Light Swarm Barrier is... I'm not quite sure on the ruling. I'm really not. Uh, because when you attack... Does it affect the monster or the guy attacking? You know, the player attacking? Either way, I'm not quite sure. We didn't get CXYZ reborn. That would have been cool. That would have been really cool. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, give me ideas for deck fixes, etc. I just want to make this deck run as, be uh, as best as possible. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.